Now to what will no doubt be a major turning point for Cleveland. The race to find Cleveland's next mayor is heating up and three more candidates filed petitions today. Laura Queso has the breakdown. Eight candidates are now in the running for Cleveland's next mayor. Three more filed petitions today. This is going to be the first contested Cleveland mayoral election in 16 years. Law professor David Carney says it could draw more attention than in years past. Mayor of Cleveland is a very important job. It affects everything from the safety of our streets to patching the streets, removing snow. And Cleveland's mayor also has an important role in in how our children are educated and how the tax dollars for that are spent. Many want that job. The Bashir Jones campaign filed Wednesday, saying more than 6,500 signatures were turned in. The Cleveland City Councilman announced his mayoral bid in May. Also on Wednesday, Cuyahoga County Deputy Sheriff Landry Simmons filed his petition. Formerly a police officer with the Cuyahoga Metropolitan Housing Authority, he serves as a member of the Cuyahoga County Republican Party Committee. Dennis Kucinich is working to win the office again for a second run after more than four decades. Meantime, Ohio State Senator Sandra Williams announced that she is entering the race filing last week. A native of East Cleveland, she has served as a state senator representing Ohio's 21st district since 2015. Attorney Ross DiBello was vying for the job. He's moved throughout Northeast Ohio and says he knows the struggle that hardworking Clevelanders face. Cleveland City Council President Kevin Kelly filed Tuesday. Kelly was first elected back in 2005 to represent Ward 13. Also, former Cleveland City Council member Zach Reed wants the job. He ran back in 2017, but lost to incumbent Mayor Frank Jackson. And Justin Bibb, a nonprofit executive, was the first major contender to formally launch a campaign. Carney says now it's up to Clevelanders to decide. I would hope that Clevelanders would appreciate how important this job is and that they will turn out and make a choice. As we reported last month, Cleveland Mayor Frank Jackson revealed that he would not be seeking re-election. The mayoral primary is September 14th. You can head to WKYC.com to find more on the candidates for mayor and a list of candidates for the 11th Congressional District as well, Betsy. Well, this change will affect every facet of our city's government. All of it. Top to bottom. Mm -hmm. So it's a big one. And the voters, it's all up to them. Exactly. All right. Thanks so much, Laura. Sure.